welcome back to a mukbang. Today we have Nico and hubby. Finally, the three of us. <laughs> it's been a long, long time. Um, so we have Vietnamese food. Um, one of the reasons why we, cho we chose Vietnamese food is Nico's favorite is pho right here. It's my so favorite food. He yep. got the beef ball noodle soup That's and favorite. then um, I have the barbecue pork yeah. and this is the barbecue rib. So I have the barbecue pork with rice, Abby beef has ribs. the rib, beef yeah. ribs. We got some papaya salad, so it's a nice little feast here. We got some spring roll and salad roll. I am excited. Nico is officially 15. 15 guys, one more year and then I can drive. So it'll be very excited next year. Get out of the way. Just kidding. <laughs> okay, shall we get started? I'm thirsty. I'm gonna have a sip of my water first. Yeah, me too. Okay. So I'm gonna pour your soup. Ooh, it's very, very hot. Like steaming. Can you guys see the steam? Originally, I actually ordered this for myself, and then he saw it and he was like, "Oh, maybe I should get fall." <laughs> Yeah, I was gonna have so we swap. So I'm eating Nico's meal, and um, he's having mine. Shall we? I need my sriracha. Right. Oops. In this corner, right mm. here. It's gonna be hard. I'm in the middle. I'm like, shoot. <laughs> no switch. No, it's okay. We will do our best. It's a treat because it's a rare, as you guys know, you've seen our videos. It's only it's always been either the two of us, Which? or Nico alone, or Emma and I as mukbang. So today's a treat for sure. It's very Not, rare. I don't think that poison sauce is enough for Nico. Well, I barely eat hoisin sauce anyway, so it's fine. He honestly just likes the plain yeah. broth. I don't. I like it with a lot of sriracha and a little bit of hoisin sauce. Did you get a spoon? This is actually your spoon. Here you mm. go. You, mean you know what? I'm going to use my hands, honestly. Because oh, they put a bit of sriracha This is in a it. huge piece of meat. Mm. Lemongrass. Barbecue pork chop. Look, it just comes right off. They put um, sriracha in here too. <gasps> Did they? Yeah. It's actually kind of nice together. To up your spice level? Well, it's, it's not really spicy. Papaya. That's papaya salad, Vietnamese style. I think the difference between Thai is there's not a lot of spice in it, right? No, there's no fish sauce. It's just like. Maybe right here. No, no, no. I mean, it's pickled. It's not mm. like that Thai style. It's plain. Yeah. yeah. Try it, Nico. You might like it. No, I'll stick with my soup first, mm, and then I'll try some. Use my hands, guys. Use your hands? Mother. <laughs> You're being Filipino? Mm? I'm so tempted to use my hands. I mean, Thai people use their hands when they mm -hmm. when we eat sticky rice, so... As a kid, I always, you know... Same here. Um, use my hands. I prefer using hands. Unless like you're eating like white rice, then we use a um, spoon and fork. I was making fun of my friend one day, like eating mm. wings and he's using a spoon and fork. <laughs> okay, wings is a different story though. Wings, you should, that's like... Yeah, you need to like, use your hands. You, need you to have use your to hands. use your hands for wings. But my buddy, he uses spoon and fork. Okay. It's just weird. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is so good. Good call on fall, Nico. Okay. No. I've been wanting beef. Oh. So I know a few people got Miko's age a little mixed up on TikTok. He's actually not 19. He's TikTok. 15. Yeah, TikTok. Because his followers over there thought he was 19 because on his um, bio. bio he's just 15 as a joke, right? So. No, not as a joke. So I don't get banned. <laughs> oh, okay. You don't get banned. I don't really understand that though. TikTok? Yeah, I don't know. I'm not on TikTok. We used to be. Well, 
Okay, look, it's kind of like Facebook. Mm-hmm. It's another app, right? It's like Instagram. Mm. I think for you guys, it should be like more Instagram reels and like Facebook. Like, I just don't get the entire social media thing. Yeah. Hubby's not on there. Except for Facebook. No, Friendster. That's Friendster. Oh, you know what? I was telling Emma, because we were in the conversation of would we ever quit social media? And I was telling her in my in our generation, we had like Asian Avenue. Do you know what Asian Avenue is? No. No, you don't know. Come on. I'm just asking. Maybe he does. Yeah, I do. You do? What is Asian it? Asian Avenue. It's like um, like a radio station. <laughs> radio station? <laughs> it's a radio station. Friendster. Move in a bit. You're a little off. MySpace. Mm, MySpace is the one that I forgot. What else is there? Um... Friendster, right? Friendster. But I think that's more like a dating app back then. No, it's just the start of Facebook. I wasn't really on it. It's just annoying because people always like try to make their profile fancy with like different colors. It's like, oh, I can't Me, do hello. <laughs> uh, I spent so much time trying to create like, like a pink theme, yeah. pink and white. And with like, Flickering lights. Yeah, with stuff. like lights, neon lights. I like the Nokia. Remember the Nico Nokia window. phone? Oh, yeah. Like different face plates and all that stuff. Do you know what a Nokia phone is, Nico? Yeah. That was like my favorite phone. I love, love playing the uh, the snake game. And there's it also. It's just so occupied. You have different lights on different ringtones. Mm. And the voicemail, play music. Hi, you have rich, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I understand that. Yeah. I Did was, you? I, yeah, I was born like. <laughs> no, that's good though. I never liked Nokia nice back in the day. I, I always have Nokia. a flip phone. I have the flip phone. Um, flip phone. If you had a flip phone razor. back then, the razor. I had a razor. You were, you were really. Baller. You were a baller and a, a really cool <laughs> kid. In my days back in the nineties, it's the pager. Mm. I don't think I had a pager. Mm. Mmm, I'm hungry. Oh, okay. How was your birthday party, Nico? Your basketball? It was great. Yeah? Was good. Tell us what you did. Um, so I invited a few friends, mm -hmm. and uh, I played the on three, and then I invited um, one of my dad's friends. So mm -hmm. we rented the entire gym for a good two hours, and he had some of his good friends there. Played. We had a. <clears throat> I didn't. I think Emma and I only stayed for the first forty minutes of it. Oh, it's forty minutes after twenty minutes. <laughs> that's, that's expected. No way. Half an hour. No, you didn't, mom. It was twenty <laughs> minutes. You did not. Was it twenty minutes? Yeah. Was it? Um, well, we were just sitting. You were like, but mind you, line. but mind you, mom. The plan was for mom to go to the restaurant first. Yeah, I know, but Which when I she did. said 40, that's a lot. <laughs> I thought it was a 40. Well, for you, it seems like it's eternity because... Ugh. Just sitting there watching. I mean, I don't mind watching, but Emma was getting a little antsy. Yeah. For me, going to his training and watching for like an hour or close to two hours, mm -hmm. sometimes wasn't even enough. Like sitting there. It's too fast? Because no, because I enjoy it. Mm. Like, you know. I like that stuff. Do you like people watching you? Like me, for example? And dad? Uh, yeah. Because you guys, like, our kids... No, I they... think it's a different story. A different feeling. If you or... <clears throat> me watches. Is there a Is difference? It different? If dad watches, if dad watches, like... I don't know. I don't know. There's no feeling to it. It's just like if you guys watch, there's nothing happening. Is there a difference though? Like it's a difference between dad watches you or I watch you. Like if you watch it and I, dad, and I did something wrong, like I'd probably like, you probably wouldn't know if I did something wrong. But if dad did it wrong, or like, no, if I did it wrong, like even if it's just like a little mistake, he would know and he would tell me. But if you like, if you saw it, you'd be like, you'd, if you. Yeah, if you if you saw it, you'd be like, "Oh no, you did good." But Dad would be like, "Ah, oh, nah." Like, 
that, that was okay, like, you know. Like mom earlier when she was like telling about the shoes. I said, why did you guys get both shoes, the same thing? I said, you have no idea, the other shoe is heavier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because we play with it. Well, that it's a different thing. If it's different when you're a basketball player. Like you understand different things. Of like, course. Just like me telling you what kind of foundation do I was gonna do, say that. Do I wear? I'm like, what would what? I you know? But considering that we haven't been involved with basketball for like So you haven't played <clears throat> in over before Nico was born. Yeah. Fourteen years, so more than that. And More then like he just got back into it for like the training that they do together. <clears throat> well, not together. Just, well, not together, but like they go together. So. They share the same passion. Like, okay, when I did fishing, dad had like no idea. Mm -hmm. But like when it's, when, when like dad knows something or like, like. He's on it. No, like when I was fishing, he can't give me tips. Mm. He can't like really do nothing. He doesn't know what to do. Or like help me out. Right. Like because I don't like fishing. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I really don't like fishing. It wasn't my thing. But you like going out in yeah. the morning. Because he's an early bird. Like? You're actually an early bird when there is something to do. Like you would get up on time, but when you have nothing to do, like he would sleep until like... I want to get my sleep. I want to get my about. sleep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Which is understandable, because I love to sleep in when I can. I keep going like this because I want you to have some room mm, Okay. I'm going to try this. It's really good. Mm. I'm going to save you this one, Nico. No, Nico can have some of this. <laughs> so go ahead, go ahead with your basketball thing. Oh, yeah. But like when it was like, um, what do you call this? Like, like during COVID? I wasn't really, I was interested in basketball, but like COVID kind of like shut me down. Like I was like consistent. So that was like two years ago, right? Yeah, that was like two yeah. years ago. I was doing like Cess basketball. There was like no really, I went to drive like basketball. I went to like some camps, mm -hmm. but it didn't really help me out. Until this year, I started to like, you know, kind of like focus I think you were more, more like progress. passionate too. Yeah, there was, there was more progression mm -hmm. and there was more like, you know, work I and had to do. why is that though? Because, um... Because I was on the basketball team and the school team and I wasn't that good. Is the coach a major factor? Yeah, it's the coach. You like your coach. This is so good. Do you like the people you play with? I think it's also the people I play with. Like, encouraging. It's not really encouraging. You can... It's like, it doesn't really like affect me if they're encouraging or not. It's just like... The environment of playing here. With like, other people? Yeah. Like, like which environment? Because you play two different... So <laughs> I play two different environments. I play with dads. Like my dad's age. Um, they're encouraging. But the dads? Like, but there's really no competition because they kind of go easy on me. I'm like, oh, what? Like, it's just mm -hmm. kind of like, you know... They, they Sometimes if I like start getting my momentum and like start shooting and getting, like, you know, shots up... They start to like, you know. Be like, oh, here comes Nico. Yeah, like, yeah, they, yeah, they yeah. try to like. No, they will even say, go Nico, go. Yeah, they will. They will encourage me, and they will try on me. They will actually try. Um, and considering they're your godfathers. Yeah. Hey, oh. <laughs> they're your Ninos. Nino. Nino. Finding Nino. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what a Nino is, Nico? Yeah. Godfather. And then um, <laughs> I think. And then in like my environment, like with like competition. There's competition. Mm -hmm. Fast pace. Yeah, it's fast pace. Oh. But with like him, it's like more like cherry picking. It's like mm -hmm. like relax and chill. It's it's more more like pickup. There's a difference between pickup and like actual game. What are you doing? That's a lot. <laughs> Give it back then. <laughs> the rice is good too with this. So? so you've been training for how long now? Like consistently? Mm -hmm. Three, no, two months. Mm -hmm. Two months. So when Emma and I, so the reason why Nico is staying behind, because Emma and I are going to Thailand first, and then these two boys will join us later. Yeah. Because of? Your basketball training 
And hanging out with some of your friends for the summer, right? Yeah. Because yeah. for the last, I guess, few years, we've never really been around here. On oh, summer. During school break and summer break, so it's going to be really nice. And of course, he's at that age where he wants to be independent. He doesn't even want to go. He doesn't want to go <laughs> hang out with his mom or dad, except for basketball. No. Spring roll. <laughs> Nico hangs out with me. Yeah, for basketball and stuff yeah. like that. But. Yeah, but I gotta win just I'm like, I gotta, like, even after basketball, we go to a restaurant and we talk about, like, basketball. Just enjoying. No, enjoyable. Mm. Whatever. But, like, with, like, the training, I think I was more, like, I would have done it earlier if I found the right trainer. Because, like, mm, yeah. finding the right trainer was a major, you know. Important key. Yeah, it's a, it's a key. It's like a, yeah, for your growth. Yeah. And you have to have the right trainer to make you be better. So for if sure. I had if I had like if I had it like last year I would have been like way better than this year, definitely. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> Cause there I had like a lot of options, so like it was like hard for me to choose between the two. That's why it took so long. And some of them weren't even available or they were just more good. I think um with a different trainer you probably wouldn't be as passionate about basketball too. The coach makes a difference, like, it makes you want to, like, be better, push push yes. yourself better. Mm -hmm. and I think finding the, co the right coach was kind of like a destiny for him. Big time destiny. Because mm -hmm. he was fully booked, right? Mm, yeah. And then, mm -hmm. no. That's really good. Fall. The other one is actually... um fried Vietnamese ham. Okay, we should move this over there. Like I am full. You're full and you said you were the most hungry. Yeah, I ate the candy. <laughs> I was going to say that. <laughs> he ate so much. And I don't like candy. I think you secretly do. No, I don't. Ask Nico. I, I don't like candy. There's certain, there's certain time, there's certain candy. No, it's like it. me with chocolate. Like, I don't like chocolate. But the certain chocolate yeah. make me want to eat chocolate. I guess. Like dad, I, I know dad he hates like like the candy is kinda like cotton candy. Oh my god, that's, he that's... loves cotton candy. <laughs> oh no 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 no, no cotton candy. And he's like I don't like sweet. No, so like, like the well, sweet... cotton candy is like, no, but like triple the sugar level. The certain there's certain candies. And... You know, hubby is diabetic, so he's he's got to watch his sugar. But when it comes to cotton candy, honestly, he I can would, finish would, the entire bag. Like I would steal it from Emma. <laughs> they would fight over it because she's, she's like, she loves sweets. Oh, yeah. So it's kind of like she takes a little bite and then he'll take the whole bag and he'll finish Like, it. I would always <laughs> ask her. I would tell Emma, are you done, Baba? Are you done? Said, yeah, yeah, just leave it there. I like, forget this. I'm just starting it. <laughs> Um, oh, sorry. And I'm telling myself, if I buy another bag, which is easier, I would finish it. But having to share with Emma, I don't feel as guilty. It makes more sense. <laughs> yeah, like, oh. <laughs> I would have bought another bag, but if yeah. I do, then... You would eat it all. Yes. So I'll eat with Emma. But Emma will tell you, that finished my cotton candy. She kind of like doesn't want to like, she doesn't like to share. When it comes to like her no, favorite, she, yeah, she her doesn't favorite like favorite thing. Yeah, like, she doesn't like to share, but then ends up after like, like if it's like an object or like something that like you know she likes. Yeah. Like a month she'll be with it, and then like the mm -hmm. next month she'll be like, oh, it's not my favorite anymore. I'm like, I wanted it too. <laughs> it's like Emma, hi Emma. <laughs> she's not here to defend herself. <laughs> hey, she's like, she'll be like, no. <laughs> oh man, I'm full. This is so good. Like, I remember with my Nintendo, I had it, oh. I like, I got it for Christmas, for me, right? Mm -hmm. Then, like, oh, she took it, and she like, loved it, she still plays it till Nintendo? today. Nintendo? Yeah. Yeah. We actually watched, um, Super Mario. Super Mario, and she loved it. She was actually, like, every time we watch, because we watch a movie together all the time, um, this was one of the movies where she was like... Into it? Into it, like, I would like, be talking. Asking her some questions, she'd be like, not listening. She's like, 
completely like zoned in. What? Yeah. Well, like she, I think Disney movies should be zoned in. She was like this, like literally. Because like. remember, every time we go to the movie theater, I'll be like, she's like so bored. She has his, she has her own entertainment. Mm -hmm. I think she likes different things. Yeah. She's not. <clears throat> well, she is getting. Year by year, these kids I... get so big. Like before, I used to like soccer. I was just, I'm more of like, you know, a sports guy. Like, I'm not. Like, I used to be a gaming guy. Hockey? You were first, into okay, hockey? First, it was hockey. I still remember when I went to that Canucks game. Mm. Uh, really? Yeah, yeah, I still remember. Remember that? We went to the Canucks game. That was like, what, six? Were you six? Yeah. Wait, I, sitting I, in I, I, no, no, I was only with dad. You were at work. Mm. Yeah. And then I went to the Canucks game, played hockey. Maybe they don't know what Canucks is. Canucks is Vancouver. They suck. <laughs> I, what, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what? Speak they, the truth. They suck. Don't hold your back. This don't is why. This is what, <laughs> the only reason why I don't like them. I, I don't like hockey anymore. So I was hockey, and then I went to soccer for like a year, and then basketball, and then I went to gaming when it was uh, oh. corn. quarantine. Quarantine. Yeah. Because like, you know, nothing to do. How about football? Outside. You were once? Well, I was once a football guy. I even asked mom if I wanted to join a football oh, team. Oh yeah, you were so on it. I was like, are you sure you wouldn't be a football? Yeah, and then, and then basketball after football. No, no, no. Before quarantine, it was basketball. And then... After quarantine, it was gaming. You no, know, but in quarantine, it was gaming. And then after, I went straight to basketball because I had the outside back. No, fishing first. Well, fishing's not really like a sport. Oh, it's, it's more like a hobby, yeah. I'd say. You can fish as a career. Yeah, as a career. If yeah. I, but I, I, would think, I would love to go like in no, the deep sea, like fishing. Oh, yeah. oh, that'd be so much fun. But I don't think he has the patience for fishing. Yeah, he's just no, wants I to do. catch it right away. What do you guys say? I, <laughs> no, you don't. I, okay, do, do you guys not remember? You're like, doot, doot, doot. <laughs> do you guys not remember when I was, uh, when you said, oh, I gotta go? I'm like, wait, let me, I have, like, it's just always every time that one cast, it's yeah. like, I feel that hope, that little hope I'm gonna get a fish. But it never happens, and I never got a bite. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna you this. keep trying. Actually, but, I'll have one. Because everything's a little salty. Thanks. This is a little candy. Do you guys you remember one? this from our candy video? You want one? Who, me? This is actually a really good. Yeah. Um, like, it's not as, like. You know what I would love right now? Mango peach pie from Jollibee. Nah. You know what I would love right now? Hello, hello. Yeah. And, um, Uncle Tito's, um, cheesecake. Mmm. Yeah. Mm. I would have watermelon right now. <laughs> well, <laughs> so much food. I was contemplating to buy watermelon today too. But oh, I know. yeah. But I know if I buy one, it's just going to sit in the fridge. Half. No, we, we ate no, it No, we all ate last it in time. the first week. Because okay. I used it for like smoothie. I wanted a smoothie <clears throat> bowl. And okay. did it work? It works. <laughs> it works. <laughs> we see. I just, I didn't have enough ingredients, that's why. I was watching him make it. I was like, Oh How's it going? <laughs> yeah, because I remember, like, you did that It stick. wouldn't blend properly, so I was like, um, I think you need a lot of little juice or water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something or like that. Vitamix? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, the smoothie bowl was really good, though. One more? No. Yeah. One more. Wow, you're going to finish the whole thing? I just look. There's 21 grams of sugar. In one. In one? No, I don't know. Per serving. So, it says... Oh, seven pieces is 42 grams. Wow. Sugar. So if you eat some of these. I'll be watermelon sugar high. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, was... you guys. Looks like we're all done here. Anything you want to say, Niga, since you're officially 15? Uh, no, I don't really. No. Say, I'll just say, I'll say a big speech when I'm 16. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.